Hello and welcome to this educational video. About celestial motions of Earth, the Sun, the Moon, and the planets. In this video, we will explore how these objects move in the sky and why they appear the way they do. What is the celestial sphere? The celestial sphere is an imaginary projection of the Sun, Moon, planets, stars, and all astronomical bodies upon an imaginary sphere surrounding Earth. Although originally developed as part of the ancient Greek concept of an Earth-centered geocentric universe, the hypothetical celestial sphere gives astronomers an important tool for fixing the location and plotting movements of celestial objects. The celestial sphere is like a giant globe that rotates around Earth once every 24 hours. The top of that globe, the point directly above your head is called the zenith, and where the globe meets Earth is called the horizon. The horizon is a circle around you that separates the visible sky from the hidden sky. The horizon can be blocked by mountains, trees, buildings, or smog. On the celestial sphere, there are two important circles that help us locate objects in the sky, the equator and the ecliptic. The equator is a projection of Earth's equator onto the celestial sphere. It divides the sky into two equal halves, the northern hemisphere and the southern hemisphere. The ecliptic is a projection of Earth's orbit around the sun onto the celestial sphere. It marks the path that the sun appears to follow in the sky throughout the year. The ecliptic crosses the equator at two points, the vernal equinox around March 21st and the autumnal equinox around September 23rd. These are the dates when day and night are equal in length. 